Good evening, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome to a new week. Today is Monday, September now, right? September. Yeah. Good evening. Good evening, Elsa. Welcome. Welcome. Thank you, sir. Okay. That's it, right? Now, today we're going to start with a new unit, unit number three. The name of the unit is Schedule Events at the Workplace. Yes, it's unit number three, right? And the class of today is class number 11. Yes. Class 11. Mm. We're moving very fast, right? Yes. Okay. Now I will share with you the the PowerPoint presentation right now. Yes. We have a lot of work to do. And later we're going to complete the, the manual, right? The manual. Too. Yes. The manual. Okay. Good. Now this is the presentation. Today is September 4th, the Independence Month. Yes, it's the Independence Day. Well, Independence Month, I mean. <laughs> right, remember uh, next week, September 15th, no classes, right? We have vacation. Vacation of classes. I don't know if you're going to work, but okay. And before to start, well, let me tell you that uh, I I need all of you to complete the platform, unit one and unit two, right? Don't forget that, okay? Good. Later I will I will tell you who needs to complete the platform, right? Yes. Okay, just give me a second. I will put this material here. Yes. Okay, good. Now, the topic is Present continue for future. Oh, present continue for future. This is the topic, right? Interesting. Now, okay. What is the topic? Let me see. Uh, Elsa, can you read the the objective for tonight, please? Hello, Elsa. Can you read the objective, please? Okay. So, Moisés, help me, please. Ah, oh, no. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Yes, Elsa. And Moisés is going to help us. Okay. Moisés, please. What is the objective for tonight? Okay. I will be able to, you need three. Uh, yep. Excuse me. Uh, I will be able to describe the future work events. Very good. Thank you. Describe the future, right? Some activities in the future there in your work, right? That's it. Now, to begin, we have some, some questions. Who is schedules the event at your workplace? What event, for example, the, the activities that you have to do together, like meetings, uh, trainings, um, visit clients, right? Make projects, send emails, um, produce uh, this or the other specific product, right? Let me see who makes that. 
Uh, let's start asking Kenya, right? Hello, Kenya. Welcome to the class, ladies and gentlemen. Kenya. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome. Uh, the question is who's scheduled? Quien, quien planifica, quien uh, arregla, right? The events at your workplace, uh, Kenya. No sé quién es el que los organiza. Bueno, honestamente, en la empresa casi no hay eventos. No, you don't have meetings, Kenya. Meetings? Meeting? No sé, teacher. No, no meetings. Okay. No, no trainings. Uh -huh. No, no again. Oh, sorry. No, no problem. No problem. I understand. Okay. So let me see. Brenda, can you help us, please? Brenda, who is in charge of planning the events in your workplace, in your company? The manager, um, the manager, the human resources, uh, workers. The managers oh. and, and me. And you? Oh, excuse me. Nice. And, and what events are you planning to make in September, Brenda? Um, capacitaciones. Mm -hmm. the, uh, sorry. To, uh, chemicals. Chemicals. Uh, chemicals. Wow. Interesting. And uh, Brenda, do you regularly do these events every month or only in September? Eh, depende. Mm -hmm. Cuando hay personal nuevo. Ah, interesting. New employees. Correct. Yes. When we have new employees, it's necessary to make these uh, trainings, capacitaciones, right? Uh -huh. Interesting. Interesting. I like it. Very good. Now, let's ask someone. Th thank you, Brenda. Thank you very much. Now, Delia, help me, please. Who is in charge to schedule the, the events? Depends, teacher. If uh -huh. uh, special uh, uh, events, events uh, my boss. Your boss. Uh, for but example, when, what, what kind of events? Um, we are going to have a, a feria. Mm -hmm. A fair? A, a fair. A, a, this um, next uh, Tuesday, no, Friday. Next, next Friday. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, uh -huh. So Friday. My, my boss um, uh, playing this event. Ah, uh, nice. And, and But when we have a meeting with clients, uh, and include my boss. Mm -hmm. uh, we, um, uh, uh, cada vendedor. Every sales person. Every, every... sales person, yeah, uh, have to schedule the the events. The events with the client, with the customer, right? Yes, ah, yes. interesting, interesting. Graphic depot, right? And you sales. A product like uh, desks, uh, graphic supplies, graphic supplies, inks, paper, things yes. like that, right? Oh, interesting, very interesting, right? Okay, to finish, Moises, help me, please. Uh, who plans the events in your company, Moises, in Catholic Relief Service, right? Yeah, um. In my workplace, uh, Miss Gracia Maria is. Gracia Maria. Gracia Maria is mm -hmm. your name. It's your name. Her name. Her name. Her, huh? it's her name. Oh, because um, my name is Javier. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> because it's a Gracia Maria is your name. <laughs> what? <laughs> Sorry, what is her name, right? I I, rem I remember to have a Gracia Maria in, in as a student. Yeah. But well, and may, maybe it's a coincidence, but. Okay. Um, okay. Uh huh. And 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 what what events? The yeah. uh, meetings, trainings, uh, parties, uh, parties. <laughs> okay. Uh, what what events? Uh, really parties. Uh, oh the, really? Yeah. Uh, Autocuido sería um um. Uh, hay un, 
Ah, hay una estrategia de, de las empresas que se llama autocuido, entonces el uh -huh. grupo, eh, ella planifica, eh, más bien es un party. It's a party, oh, a interesting. Party. Interesting, you know. <laughs> eh, ok, eh, interesting. Pues, so, when, when is the party? Next week. Uh, September, the September. Uh, 20, 25 of September or 25th is Monday, yeah. September 25th. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, a party on Monday is interesting. <laughs> the <Well>. Autocuido, <laughs> Autocuido. <laughs> okay, uh, so uh, be careful, do not slide in a cascara de you know. The <laughs> okay, do you understand, right? Okay, very good. Thank you, Moises. Thank yeah. you, everybody. So this is uh, the way you plan, you know, the things, right? Okay. We're going to discuss some vocabulary for today's class, right? We have this yearly. Yearly is every year. For example, uh, we have auto autocuido, one party every year, right? I don't know. I, I imagine. <laughs> Yeah, yearly. You plan this yearly, right? Deliver is to bring, to take, to transfer something, right? You can deliver product, you can deliver documents, etc., etc., right? Committee. The committee is a group of people appointed for a specific function, right? I don't know. For example, in my work, we have an emergency committee, right? For any emergency we have, uh, the committee works. And then they say, we have to do this, that, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, right? Okay, this is the information. Now, uh, we have here a conversation, right? And we have Peter. Peter. But this is not Peter Parker, the Spider-Man. <clears throat> Excuse me. Peter say hello, Henry. I have a question. Sorry, sorry. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. I don't know if, if it is Maria del Carmen or Maria René, but it's Maria, right? Who is in charge? But Julie is attending the conference this year too. So I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the, the presentation for the CEO next week? CEO is a executive. No, it's chief, sorry. Cafe, right? Chief executive officer. <clears throat> chief executive officer, CEO, right? CEO. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, and then he says, Henry, guess what? I am. I am presenting the uh, with Hector, the new accountant. And Peter says, sounds great. So, I am informing the committee about it. Okay, again, faster, normal, right? Hello, Henry. I have a question. We're representing the company in the yearly conference. Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Yuli is attending the conference this year, too. So, I see. But if Yuli is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. Okay, class, now ready? 
Let's practice the, the conversation. Repeat after me, please. Hello, Henry. I have a question. I have a question. I who, have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So, I see. But if Julie is attending, Who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. In a good Salvadoran, Salvadoran, que chivo, right? <laughs> so, I am informing the committee about it. Okay, good. Any question, class, about any word that you don't understand? Any question? Teacher. Yes, tell me, Moises. Jerry is uh, annual. Um, An annual, yes. Is a diario is per diem. Uh, a diario is daily. Daily. Mm -hmm. what, what, uh, what is uh, per diem? Per. Who's, who's the per diem? No, I don't get it. You, just give me a second. Daily. Mm -hmm. Daily. Right? Daily. Mm -hmm. uh, weekly, monthly, and yearly, right? Yeah. Yes, every day, every week, every month, every year. Okay. But but the expression, can you repeat again, please? Per DM. Per DM. Es como cuando uno hace un DM, es con D, DM, es como cuando uno hace una liquidación este, de, de viáticos y dice, ¿cuál, ¿cuál es tu per DM? Dice, ¿cuál es el per DM o como la tarifa del, del viático? Eh, algo así está relacionado, pero no, no capto. Voy a buscar my, la my, palabra. My goodness, I am totally lost because I don't know about <laughs> counting, but if, let me look in the, in the, but if you want, can you tell me letter by letter, Moises? Because I, I don't get it. Sorry. I don't understand. Per uh, um, D M. So, like, like this? Pero está como, como separado el, el per, el per um. DM. Uh, for example. Uh, per si day. Yo, per day? No, per DM. DM. E, e M. Uh, I E M. I. No, D. I D. 
<risa> no, no, lo voy a, lo voy a buscar y se lo copio. No en inglés, en inglés, come on. Ok, D, D, no, D, 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 E, E, D, E, uh, D, M, uh, que sería la I, uh, In English, right? <laughs> D E. Uh, se lo voy a escribir en el chat mejor, porque si okay, no, please, no please, uh, sorry. <laughs> Excuse me, I am totally lost because you know, per uh, a continuous is a mystery for me. <laughs> it's a mystery. Send it, please. I will, I will read it and then I, I will try to look for you. Ya lo voy a, okay. lo voy a buscar el, en la, en la hoja de. Porque siempre he tenido que significar... DM. Ah, yes, I know DM. DM, DM, ajá. Uh -huh. Per DM. Uh -huh. This one, yes, I got it. Yeah, I, I, I'm more familiar with this word. But yes, it, technically I don't understand, but we're going to look, don't worry. Just okay. give me some seconds, yes. Okay, thank you. I will look for you. Per DM. Okay, class, now uh, I will take the the attendance right but i see i have some messages here maybe people that is driving algunos chicos que van manejando me imagino let me see este día estoy trabajando ah okay I understand is is very important wilfredo so he's a listener wilfredo okay then i have uh, the message Enrique, good night, oh, good evening, right? In I'm leaving work. I'll be listening, right? Enrique. Okie dokie, Enrique. Mr. Rosales Acevedo, right? Uh, okay, then I have William Wilfredo Renderos. CN, CNC. I don't understand, but he's working. Okay. Very good. So now let's go to the conversation, right? And then repeat the last time. Ready? And then we're going to ah, sorry, excuse me. I will I will take the attendance, excuse me. Okay, ready? Uh, Ada. Hello, Ada. Uh -huh. Brenda Lee. Brenda. Present. Thank you. Carlos. Present. Francisco. Delia. Present teacher. Elsa. Present teacher. Erenia. Present. Evelyn. Present teacher. Freddy. Ingrid. Present teacher. Jessica Araceli. Jessica Carolina. Jonathan. Present teacher. Kenya. Present teacher. Este día estaré de oyente, estoy oh. hasta en el hospital. Ah, oh, yes, I know, I understand, yes. María. Mirecinos Méndez. Ok. María René. Present. Mateo. Present. Moisés. Present teacher. Alexis. Alexis, sorry. Alexi. William. Present. Welcome, William. And Wilmer. Okay. Then I have three messages, four messages, right? Let me see. Uh, Brenda Lee. 
present, right? Pero no sé si va a estar de oyente. Vamos a mandar el mensaje aquí. No, teacher. No, no, participando. Ok, good. <laughs> ok. Sí. Ok, thank you very much, Brenda Lee. Good, thank you. Let me see, veamos quién más está aquí. Present, Jessica Araceli. Vamos, Jessica, necesito que me participe también. Um, vamos a ver aquí, estará de oyente. Estará de oyente. Question. <ríe> ok. Y tengo a María. Sí, María me ha dicho que va a estar de oyente. Marisha. Thank you, María. Y lo que no veo el mensaje de quién va, quién va a dar la semita esta noche. ¿Quién es? No entiendo. Yes. Ay, ah, por aquí está otro mensaje de Moisés. Vamos a ver. Esto está interesante. Vamos a ver. Permítame, Moisés, aquí vamos a compartirlo. Dice, formato de presupuesto, per diem, ah, va unido. Primera vez que lo veo en mi vida, Moisés. Eh, ah, ok. Viendo teacher, por lo que yo lo uso. Sí, sí. Eh, a eh, diario. Okay. A diario, per diem. Ajá. Ya lo vamos a averiguar. <risa> Permítame, que aquí ya, ya me metí en otro lugar que no sé dónde. Ya me perdí. Ahí está. Ya estamos aquí otra vez. Permítame que quiero ver que todos vean la conversación. Ahí estamos ya. Ok. Per diem. Interesting. Interesting. Luego tengo a Wilmer. Presente teacher. Estoy con la conexión. Lo siento, Wilmer, pero si se puede conectar, pues ahí me avisa. De momento lo voy a poner de oyente. Muy bien. Y tengo a Wilfredo. Sí, está presente. No hay problema, Wilfredo. Bueno. Este. Solo tengo uh, de oyentes a Enrique. Kenia, María. Wilfredo y Wilma. Estamos de oyente, ¿verdad? Este, Jessica Araceli, pues no me dice si va a estar de oyente o está fallando el micrófono, no sé, espero que sea el, el micrófono, ¿verdad? Para que pueda participar con nosotros también, Jessica Araceli, oiga. Ok. Now, let's practice the last, the last time the conversation, right? Ready? Ok, repeat after me again for the last time. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So, I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So, I am informing the committee about it. Very good. Now, we're going to start with the conversation. Ready, boys and girls, for the action? Are you ready to make 
the best conversation, your best effort. Remember, participation is very important. Eh, entiendo que muchos de ustedes tienen muchas ocupaciones o que vienen del trabajo, etcétera, etcétera. Pero recuerden que la práctica es muy importante para aprender inglés. Así es que, por favorcito, eh, tratemos de arreglar nuestros horarios para poder participar en clase, porque solo de esa forma vamos a mejorar. De otra forma, solo yendo, pues, se puede, pero es más, más difícil si no lo practica. Uh, Moisés, the word comes from the Latin. La palabra viene del latín. Okay. Y básicamente quiere decir por día. Uh, per, por, y diem es día. Bueno, yo no sé latín, ¿verdad? pero así lo encontré, por diem, por, por día. Y es un término exclusivo de trabajo. O sea, no se usa en otro, en medicina, en biología, en, solo en, en trabajo, especialmente en contaduría, como usted dice, ¿verdad? Ok, entonces yo tendría que decirle muchas gracias, querido maestro. Ah, oh, no. <risa> sir, yes, sir. <risa> no, maestro me suena como uh, sensei. <risa> no, 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 teacher. I'm your friend, Moisés, come on. Thank you, teacher. Ok, good. Now, let me see. We're going to start with uh, Brenda Lee. And Brenda, the BB. Ladies and gentlemen, Brenda Lee, you are Peter, and, and Brenda, you're Henry, right? Okay, let me see. Are you ready, girls? Action. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is represent, representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Mary is, but July is attending the conference this year too, so. I see, but is Julie, Julie is attending. Who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Who is what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am forming the committee about it. Okie dokie. Thank you very much. Good pronunciation, right? O only this. Look, guess. Guess what? Adivina qué, right? Guess is suponer, adivinar, right? Suppose, I suppose. Suppose what, you know? Guess what? I am. I am presenting, you know? Okay, thank you very much, girls. Now I have Carlos, Mr. Carpio Abarca, against, I guess, no, with uh, Ms. Gonzalez Sanchez, right? Ms. Gonzalez Sanchez, can you help me? Hey, please? Hey. Uh, Carlos is going to be Peter, right? And, and Delia, hey. you're going to be Henry. Ladies and gentlemen, action. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So. I see, but uh, Julie is attending who is delivering the presence for the CEO. Next Carlos, sorry, 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 Carlos. Delivering, delivering, delivering the presentations, the presentation for the CEO next week. Week. Guess what? I am. I am present presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sound great. So I am informing the. Ya no veo. The committee. The <laughs> the committee. About it. About it. Me, uh -huh. Que me sale recortado. Ah, pues ahorita Pero mismo. La última línea no, no me sale. Ahorita mismo se lo arreglamos, permítanme. Yes. Ok. Carlos, hoy sí. Hoy lo... sí. Yes. Sounds great. Sounds great. So I am. Informing the committee about about why about it about, about it, it. Mm. 
Yes. Look at look Abaole. at my look at my lips, Carlos. Ba ba. Bao. About. Bauray. Bauray. About it. About about it. Separate it, you want. About it. About it. Now together. About it. About it. That's it, Carlos. Thank you very yeah. much, man. You did it very well. Now, Elsa, please, I need your help, Elsa. You and Irene are going to practice the conversation. Uh, okay, tell me if you prefer this form or the other form, because I don't know this if you form. can see. This is okay? Yeah. But... Yes, you can see, right? Okay, good. Now, in this case, Elsa, you're going to be Peter, and Elenia, you're going to be Henry. Ladies and gentlemen, one, two, three, action. Give me a second. This is Elsa, right? Elsa? Yeah. Uh, hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year to see. I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Yes, what? I am. I am presenting with Hector Linear Accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. Okie dokie. I am informing the class about your presentation, Elsa and Erenia, and you did it very well. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, Dino, what is your opinion about the conversation of Erenia and Elsa? Yeah, in my opinion, you did very well, girls. Nice. Yeah. Okay, very good. Excellent. It's the opinion of Dino. Thank you, Dino. No? Dino is an expert in English, you know. Also, he is, you know, because he studied a long time ago. <laughs> English, right? From the prehistoric, he's still studying, you know, English. Okay, good. Now I'm going to have Evelyn, ladies and gentlemen, Miss Fuentes Parada, and uh, Ingrid, right? Ingrid. So uh, in this case, Evelyn, you're going to be. Um, going to be. Ah, I hear a beautiful voice over there, right? Alguien está escuchando la clase también. Felicito. Sí. Okay. Uh, Evelyn, you're going to be Peter. And okay. uh, Henry is going to be uh, Ingrid, right? <laughs> okay, ready? Okay. Here we go. Okay. Hello, Henry. I have a question. <laughs> Who is representing the company in the yearly mm -hmm. conference? A <laughs> baby! Oh, wow. Hey, hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie, but Julie is attending the conference this year to Sue. I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the representation for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. Asombrante. Yes. Thank you, Ingrid and, and Evelyn. Now let's go to the next one, please. Uh, Jonathan versus, no, Jonathan and Maria Rene, right? Jonathan, you are uh, Peter. Maria Rene, you're Henry, right? Right. Action.
Hello, Henry. I have a question. What is the, what is representing the company in the yearly conference? Okay, listen, Jonathan. Who is? Say, who is? Who is? Yearly conference. Who is? Oh, yearly conference. Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year too. So. I see, but is Julie is attending. What is the library? The presentation for the CEO next week. Good, listen, Jonathan, who is delivering? <coughs> who is the, delivering? Who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Yes, what I am, I am presenting with Hector the new account. Sound great? No, no, wait, 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 Jonathan, listen, with emotion, right? Like, Sounds great. Like, like Jonathan, like you say in Salvador, que chivo, right? Okay, come on. Sounds okay. great. Sounds great. So I am informed informing the community about it okay okay thank you very much thank you very much okay maria rene and jonathan thank you now i have uh moises and um yes and mateo yes so moises you are your henry and um mateo you're peter right there you go, boys. Action. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Uh, hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Jill is attending the conference this year too. So. I see, but is Julie is attending who is delivering the presentation for the 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 CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sound great. So I am informing the committee about it. Thank you very much, Moises and Mateo. Mateo, do you work in Digitech or do you work for the radio? Uh, Digitech. Uh, I thought you work for the radio because you, your voice is like a locutor, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. Moises and Mateo. Nice. Now I have uh, William. William Antonio is going to be Peter. And Ada uh, is going to be Henry. Are you ready? Okay. One okay, wait, wait a minute. I will go here. Say yes. One, two. Uh, again, William is Henry, and Ada is Peter. Right? Action. Hello, Henry. I I am a question. I have a Would question. It... I have a question. I have. I have a question. What is rep represents the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is good. Julie is attending the conference this year too. So I see, but. If Julie in attending was is delivery the presentation the presentation for the CEO next week. Okay, again, Ada, who is delivering? Who is delivery? Good, thank you. Okay. 
Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. So great. So I am informed the committed ab about it. Thank you, Adam. But listen, sounds great. Sounds great. Good. Excellent. Very good. William and Ada, congratulations for your participation, right? That is very nice. Okay, class. Uh, now, I want you to pay attention in the next sentence. Pay attention, please. The first sentence I need you to pay attention is this sentence. Julie is attending. Julie is the subject. Is is the verb. And attending is the present participle, right? What is a present participle? Do you know what is a present participle? A present participle. Attending in a It's a uh -huh, correct. It's a verb plus ing. For example, in this case, the word attend, right? At assistir. Attend plus ing. Equal to say, attending, right? Asistiendo. Julie está asistiendo, right? O asistirá, right? It's, because you're talking about the future, right? Okay. Now, uh, we use the present continuous, right? To describe something that is happening in the moment. But this is one of the uses. You can also use the present continuous to describe something in the future. But this future is very close. It's not like in three years or in four years, no, it's uh, next week, tomorrow, tonight, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, it's, it's a, a close future. It's un futuro cercano, right? Understand? So that is the use of the present continuum for the future. I'm sorry, excuse me, excuse me. Good. Now, look at this. Also, we have this one, right? Uh, Julie is attending. Okay. Julie is attending. And I am presenting. And finally, I am informing. All of these situations are the future. No, It's not happening in the moment, right? And then we have Julie, the subject verb to be is attend, that is the verb plus ing, attending. I is the subject verb to be am, and presenting is the present participle, that is the verb plus ing, right? And finally, I am informing. I is the subject, am is the, the verb to be, and informing is the present participle, right? I repeat, this reference is about the future. So one of the uses of the present continuum, I say, is the future, right? But we're going to answer this, this question, right? He is present with a new employee. He is present what? He is present presenting presenting very good he is pres i will make it black let me see that's it right he is presenting let me see oh nice he is presenting with the new employee and i I is I no. I, I am. am. Totally right. I am. Is the verb to be right. I am informing the committee about it. So this is the way you use the present continuous, right? Verb to be is, are, and am. 
plus a verb that in this case is present and inform, but you just change adding ing, right? Notice that in inform, yes, uh, you will add, add ing, but, but in other verbs, like in invite, make, right? You eliminate the e, and then you copy ing. In the case of subject, I mean subject, a consonant, vowel consonant, you double the last consonant and n, and then you add ing. Cut, cutting, drop, dropping. So this is when we have consonant, vowel, consonant, right? This is the situation, right? Okie dokie. Now it's time to practice. Time to practice, class. Good. The present continue, right? Let's start with affirmative, right? We use affirmative using the subject, of course, right? The, the person who made the action. Number two, uh, with the verb to be, am, um, are, and is, right? And then with a verb, plus ing, says wear, wearing, shave, shaping, shaving, sorry. Take, taking, rain, raining, watch, watching, exercise, up and down, up and down, exercising, right? These are the present parts. Notice that in the verb shave, here, right? Excuse me, excuse me, shave, uh, exercise, and take, right? What do you do, class? You eliminate the E, then you add ING. Oops. You eliminate the E, and then you add ING. Yeah. Good exercise. You eliminate the E, and then you add ING. Shaving, exercising, taking, right? Okay? Good. Now, in negative, you use the word not. Not, right? And you can make contraction if you want. Instead of say, I am, you can say, I'm not wearing a jacket. Look, I'm not wearing a jacket. You're not making lunch. Mm -mm. You can also say, you aren't making lunch. She's not taking a shower. No, 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 no. Take, no, she's not taking a shower. Or you can say she isn't taking a shower. Two options, right? Two options. You contract the subject and the verb to be, and the other one, you contract the verb to be with the word not. So you say isn't, right? It is not snowing. Let me see. No, in El Salvador, never. Maybe in Chalatenango, maybe, right? Normally here. Today, for example, it's very hot. How can we have snow, right? So it's not snowing. Or is, it isn't snowing. And then we have the word uh, read. So we're not reading or we aren't reading. And finally, they are not taking a nap or they aren't taking a nap. Good. Now let's practice pronunciation. Repeat after me, class. Come on. Let's do it. Repeat. I'm wearing a sweater. You're shaving. She's taking a bath. It's raining. We're watching TV. They're exercising. Now, in negative, 
Repeat us to me, please. I'm not wearing a jacket. You're not making lunch. You aren't making lunch. She's not taking a shower. She isn't taking a shower. It's not snowing. It isn't snowing. We are not reading. We aren't reading. They're not taking a nap. They aren't taking a nap. A nap is a short sleep, right? A short sleep. Okay, class, any question? This is the grammatical structure for the present continuous class in affirmative and negative. Questions? Okay, this is the structure. Look. The subject I, she, they, Pedro, Maria, Juan, Antonio, eh, William, Ada, Mateo, etc., etc. Then the verb to be. Am, um, is, or are. And then a present participle, right? Uh, in this case, having, coming, and working. Let's read the sentences. Listen. I am having a training. She is coming late tonight. They are working tomorrow. Okay. Now, William, can you read the sentences again, please, for the class? Read. I am having a training. She is coming late tonight. They are working tomorrow. Thank you very much. Now, this is the structure, right? Now, we're going to practice some actions. Look, look at the pictures, right? Number one, eat. Yum, yum, yummy, yummy, yummy. Uh, drinking. Cooking. Reading. Reading. Uh, studying. Teaching. Singing. Sleeping. Swimming. Planting. Watching TV. Listening to music. Playing cards. Playing baseball. Playing the piano. Ton, 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 ton. Okay. Very good. Now repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Eating. Drinking. Cooking. Reading. Studying. Teaching. Singing. Sleeping. Swimming, planting, watching TV, listening to music,
playing cards. Playing baseball. Playing the piano. Okay, class. You're paying attention. I will take the attendance for the second time. Ada, say present, please. Present, present. Eh, Brenda Lee? Present. Brenda? Present. Carlos Armando? Carlos? San Miguel present. Okay. Eh, Francisco? Delia? Present teacher. Elsa? Present teacher. Erenia? Present. Evelyn? Present teacher. Ingrid? Present teacher. Jessica Araceli? Jessica Carolina? Jonathan? Present. Stephanie, no, Kenya, Kenya, sorry. Listen, right? Está de escuchante. Listener, ok. María, de escuchante también. Listener. María René. Present. Mateo. Present. Moisés. Present teacher. Alexi. Wilfredo. Está oyente, Wilfredo, right? William. Present. Thank you. Wilmer. De oyente. Okay. I have two messages here. Okay. Tengo dos mensajes. Eh, María. En Enrique. Siguen de oyente. Excelente uso. María. En Enrique. Están de siguiendo oyentes. Bueno, aquí vamos. Now. Any question class about these actions? No questions? Okay, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, let's continue. Good. Here we have some examples, right, of people using the present continuous. Uh, the boy said, what are you doing? And the lady said, I'm reading. But you can also say, I am I am reading, right? Uh what are you doing? Notice that when I say you, you, and you, one time is singular because it's only one girl, right? So you is two, usted, vos, usted. <laughs> You know, and you, when there are uh, two people, for example, when I refer to my students, say you, usted, right? So it's plural. So you is singular, you is plural. Then uh, they say, we're cooking, right? Son chinitos, están cocinando ahí. Es algún gato, un gato del vecino o algo están cocinando. Okay. Then what, uh, what are Mary, oh, Mary. Mary, Maria René, right? Maria del Carmen, right? What are Mar Mary and Fred doing? They're studying English. Oh, congratulations to this guy, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, now, we're going to do something. Uh, can you help me, William? You're going to make the questions to Ada, and Ada will respond, right? Understand? So, William says, what are you doing? And then... Uh, Ada is going to say, I'm reading, right? Okay. Go ahead, William. Make the question. What are you doing, Ada? I am ready. What are you doing, Ada? Where are, where are cooking? We're, 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 Cooking. Cooking, uh -huh. Continue, William. What are Mary and Fred doing? 
They are studying English. Oh, only that? Oh, excuse me. I was waiting for another. <laughs> excuse me. I say another conversation. No, because we have one, two, three, three conversations only, right? <laughs> okay, que oso, que oso. Okay. Thank you, William. Another. Thank you very much. Now let's go to the next. Good. It's the same situation, but it's other people. Listen, what's Tom doing? He's eating. What's Marta doing? She's watching TV. What's your dog ruff, 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 doing? It's sleeping, right? Okay, good. Now, uh, I will have uh, Brenda Lee make the questions again, please. And Brenda answer the questions. Ready? Action, girls. Brenda Lee, Brenda, can you help me? Okay, so Carlos, please. Carlos, you and Delia. Carlos, you make the questions, Delia the answer, right? Ready? Action. Okay. Desde el inicio. Yeah, please. What's Tom doing? What's Tom doing? doing? He's, sitting. He's sitting. What's Marta doing? She's watching TV. What's your dog? Going. It's sleeping. Okay. Perrito dormilón, right? Very good. Yes. It's sleeping. Very good. Delia, do you have dogs? Perf? No. Oh. Yes. I only have polar. But... Polar is temperamental. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, uh, teacher, está... Uh, está fallando el micro. Sí es. Uh... Sorry, no. I don't see. Ah, okay, Brenda Lee. Thank you, Brenda Lee. I understand. Don't worry. Okay, we are going to wait for you. Good. Now, let's continue, right? Good. Uh, here we have some sentences. Some of these sentences are affirmative. So you're going to change <laughs> this affirmative, affirmative into negative, right? Let's start with the first one. She's listening to music. I'm going to start with Elsa, please. Let's change this into negative, Elsa, please. She's not listening to music. My goodness, it's perfect. She's, we use the contraction, not listening to music. Okie dokie. Thank you. Now, Erenia, please, number two. My sister is visiting friend right now. Change it, please. My sister not visiting friends right now. Mm-hmm. Vale, give me a second here. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. My sister. Here. Uh -huh. My sister is not, right? Or we can say is if you want, right? Yes. Visiting yeah. mm -hmm. friends. A la cherada, right? Right now. My sister isn't visiting friends right now. That's good, right? Now, uh, who's next? Evelyn, please. Can you help me, Evelyn? Next sentence, please. I'm checking email. Negative, Evelyn. Oh, 
Okay, Ingrid, please help me, Ingrid. I guess the internet is not working, right? So and uh, I'm not checking uh, email. Okay, very good. I'm not checking email. Very good. Asombranti. Yeah, right. Now number four. Charles is cleaning the house. What is the negative for Charles is cleaning the house? Um, Jonathan, please. Charlie is not clean the clean cleaning cleaning, cleaning uh -huh. cleaning in the house. Charles, can I use contraction? Charles. Charles. No, oh, you can say Charles. Yes, you can make this Charles cleaning. It's possible. Or you can say, listen, Jonathan, Ethan cleaning the house. Right? Okay. Very good. Next one, number five. I have a message here. Uh, Maria, ready. Nice, Maria. Welcome to the participation. Okay, yes. Let me erase, Maria. Good. Uh, Charles isn't cleaning the house, right, Jonathan? Thank you very much. Now we have Coincident, Maria. This is your turn, eh, Maria? Let's do it. The number five, please. Let me check this. Our friends are playing soccer in the park. Aha, uh -huh, Maria. Negative. Say, so, yeah, our friends mm -hmm. are not. Our not... friends. Are not. Or you can make contraction, right, Maria? You uh, can say aren't, right? Yes? Aren't, yes. Mm -hmm. Our friends aren't playing soccer in the park. Soccer in the park. Okie dokie, your friends aren't playing soccer in the park. Good. Now, uh, we're going to do something, right? One student is going to tell me affirmative. The other student is going to tell me negative, right? Uh, Maria Rene, you say affirmative. And Mateo, you say negative, right? Understand? Okay, ready? Maria Rene, are you ready? Yes. Yeah. One, two, three. Action. She's listening to music. Mateo. She's she's not listening to music. Listening. Listening to music. Good. Continue. Continue. My sister is visiting friends right now. My sister isn't visiting visiting friends right now. I'm checking email. I am I am not checking email. Charles Charles is cleaning the house. Charles isn't cleaning the house. Our friends are playing soccer in the park. Our friends aren't playing soccer in the park. Congratulations. That's nice, right? Good reading, good reading. Yes, I like it. Now let's go to the next one, the next exercise. More practice, more conversations. Right. My Ah, oh, I have more. Yes. I have more sentences, right? We're going to make it very fast, right? Okay, good. My dad's taking a shower. Selma is taking a nap in the living room. They're studying vocabulary for tomorrow's class. 
my family is watching TV right now. And Elaine, no sé quién es Elaine, you know, and her family, aquí tenía que haber puesto Carmen, o, I don't know, right? <laughs> But Elaine, okay, good. Then uh, I need sentence number six. Uh, we have Moises. Sentence number seven, William. Sentence number eight, Ada. Sentence number nine, Brenda Lee or Brenda. Depends, right? And sentence number 10, Carlos, Mr. Carpio Abarca. Ready? Okay, here we go. Ready. My, my dad, my dad. Thinking. I no, show. because remember it's negative, right? You're going to change affirmative to negative, Carlos. Mm -hmm. My dad's not. Not taking a shower. My dad is not taking a shower. Perfect. Okay. Number Selma, seven. Uh, Selma isn't taking. Selma is in the living. This area de Sirnoa. Taking. And I'm in okay, the thank you, Moises. World. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay, give me a second. Dice, teacher, estaré oyente. Eh, creo que el micrófono está fallando. Uh, Brenda Lee. Oh, qué lástima. Brenda Lee, wow. Esto micrófono, ¿verdad? Yo creo que a Jessica Araceli el micrófono le está molestando. Me parece que en el curso anterior tenía problemas, ¿verdad? Y ahora le está fallando también a Brenda Lee. Bueno, vamos a ver. Who's next? Number eight, please. No sé si era la que me tocaba en el I guess William, William right? Let me yes. see. Eh, we have... Uh, permítame. Moisés, ¿verdad? Moisés participó, entonces sería sí. Sí, William, yes. It's yours. It's all yours. They're not student vocabulary for uh -huh. tomorrow's class. They're not studying vocabulary, vocabulary. They're not studying vocabulary for tomorrow's class. Oopsie. Sorry, me quedo mal. Sorry. <laughs> Excuse me, class. Perdonen por los osos a veces, ¿verdad? They're not studying vocabulary for tomorrow's class. Right. Okay. Ahora sí. Thank you very much. Now. Ada, dijimos, ¿verdad? Ada, number nine. Sí. Yes. Mi family is my, not. My family. My family. My family is not. Oh, me contraction TV. by Ada. Isn't. Easy, uh, easy, easy. Watch TV. Watching, watching, watching TV. Right, right now. now. Right now, in this moment, right? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now, eh, ¿quién seguiría? Eh, Carlos. Carlos again, right? Mm. Me parece que Carlos acaba de participar, pero bien, Carlos. Hello. Let's do it, Carlos. Ladies and gentlemen, from San Miguel, Elaine. Elaine. In not. And. And her family are eating breakfast. 
family but negative are negative not, right? are, are not, not or aren't you can say aren't uh, aren't bueno aren't eating 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 break breakfast breakfast right eating breakfast breakfast, breakfast. yes nice right so in, in this case, I will have uh, Delia. You make affirmative, Delia. And Elsa, you're going to say negative. Delia, affirmative. Elsa, negative, right? Ready? One, two, three, action. My dad, my dad's taking a shower. My dad's not taking a shower. Selma is taking a nap in the living room. Selma isn't taking taking a nap in the living room. They are studying vocabulary for tomorrow's class. They are not studying vocabulary for tomorrow's class. Tomorrow. My family. Tomorrow. My family is. Sorry. <laughs> excuse me. <laughs> Sorry for the interruption. Tomorrow's class. Tomorrow's class. Yeah. Delia? My family is watching TV right now. My family isn't watching TV right now. Elaine and her family are eating breakfast. Elaine and her family are eating breakfast. Nice. Congratulations, right? That's it. That's it. That's it. Let me see how estamos con el tiempo. Yeah, we have time. Very good. Because there are many activities with the present continuum, right? Now, let me raise this. Let's continue, babies. Good, class. Uh, these are the rules for making the, the, um, the present participle, right? Number one, Rule number one says you're going to add ing to most verbs. To the majority of verbs, you just add ing, right? Number two, if the verse ends in e, you drop, borrar, you know, drop the e, and then you add ing. Then number three, if the verb has a consonant, vowel consonant, one consonant, one vowel, and one consonant, they make the sandwich to the vowel. You double the last consonant and add ing. Okay, for example, take, taking. Read, reading. Watch, watching. In the case of may, take, and come, you, the e, right? And then you add ing. Then in verbs like get, run, shop, drop, oh, many verbs, right? That is consonant, vowel consonant. You double the last consonant and then add, add ing, right? Shop, pp, ing. Run, and n, ing. Get, getting, double t, 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 right? Other ones are, for example, swim, swimming, right? Double M. Mm -hmm. Good, class. Any question about these rules? You have to memorize the rules, right? Only that. And remember, this is not for the present simple, the, the simple past. No, this is for present continuous, right? Three rules only. Este, este yeah. tema es el que menos reglas tiene, ¿verdad? El pasado simple tiene un montón. Y el presente tercera persona yeah, well, también. Yes. Hay que aprendérselo, ¿verdad, Carlos? Ya Carlos ya está yes. aprendiendo. La primera es la más fácil, ¿verdad? Solo le agrega ING. <laughs> Yes. Tiene toda la noche para estudiar, <ríe> Carlos. Ok, good. Uh, aprovechando sí. si hacen algunas preguntas, este, la mayoría ya me terminó en la unidad 2 y el examen. 
quiero felicitar especialmente a, a Evelyn y a Wilfredo que ya terminaron todo, están libres esos niños ya ya no deben nada ustedes pueden hacerlo si quieren verdad ahí es opción de ustedes, solo que requiere un poquito más de tiempo eh, luego voy a mencionar a los chicos que sí van al día tengo a Ada a Brenda Lee, a Brenda a Carlos Ajá, Francisco también, Adelia, a Elsa, Evelyn, como ya dije, eh, Freddy, también Valdía, Ingrid Valdía, que es tanto el examen de midterm como la unidad 1 y 2, ¿verdad? Jonathan, Kenia, María del Carmen, Moisés, que ahí su terminada tres meses. Está bien. Ok, ¿qué más? Alexi. Sí. Eh, Wilfredo. Ya dije que lo terminó todo, ¿verdad? Wilfredo y, y Evelyn son los que lo han terminado todo. Y William. ¿Verdad? De ahí los demás, pues le falta uno, dos o tres actividades. Así que, por favor, hagámoslo, chicos. Recuérdense que tanto las actividades de la plataforma como la participación en clase es lo que les da el pase para el básico 3. ¿Any question? ¿Questions? No. Okay, let's continue, right? Now, we have some verb, right? Melanie is it. What is the present party for, for it? Now, in this case, I will ask volunteers, right? Eat. No, no, Eat. Voy a, no voy a asignar voluntarios, ustedes solitos. Okay. Volunteers, Eat. please. Eating. How do you spell that, Delia? E. Teacher, present is eating. Is it. Um, present continuous eating. E? E-A-T. No, no, I. Oh, sorry. I. N-G. Eating, correct. Yes. Melanie is eating oh. her lunch, right? Number two. Another volunteer? Silvia is Silvia is putting on. Aha, uh -huh. putting on, putting on. P P U T-T-I-N-G. O-N. Good. Silvia is putting on makeup in the bathroom, in the restroom. Our children are... Okay, volunteers, please. No me dejen solita, Adelia. Vamos, sí. participemos sí. todos, chicos. Sí. Ah. Get it out. That is William, right? Thank you, William. G. G E T T E N G. I. I. N G. N G. And then up, right? Uh, our children are getting. Uh, late tomorrow morning, right? Uh -huh. Good. Later, I'm go. Aquí, ¿qué pasó? I am. Ah, yes, go shopping. Yes, go shopping. Yes. So, what is the, what is the, with the verb? Going shopping. Going shopping. Is that possible? Podemos tener dos oraciones con ING, dos verbos. ¿Será posible? 
en ese caso. We don't pero... know, but just yes. <risa> no, 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 no importa el teacher. Ah, como el teacher lo dice, se puede. Pero no, no, come on. You think. Tell me, right? What do you think? Yes or no? Vamos a preguntarle al, al sabio de sabios. Going shopping, ¿es correct o incorrect? Dino. Um, totally correct. Yes. Going es el verbo y shopping es el, el nombre de una actividad. Entonces, shopping no es un verbo. Es un nombre de algo, de una actividad, ¿no? De compras, ir de compras. Estamos yendo a comp de compras, right? ¿Understand? En ese caso aplican los tres porque ahí está el, el verbo to be, go y shopping. Ajá, pero solo es el verbo to be, am y el verbo going. El verbo to be es auxiliar y el verbo principal, porque siempre hay un verbo principal, no, no se pueden dos verbos principales o tres verbos principales, solo debe ser uno. Entonces, esto es como cuando yo digo, para que vean otro ejemplo, I am going swimming. Entonces, swimming solo es el nombre de una actividad, nadar, ¿no? Y el going es el verbo, el verbo, sorry. ¿Understand? Yes. Entonces, sí se puede, sí se puede, right? Okay, good. Volunteers, please. Janet is... Coming. Coming. How do you spell that? C-O-M-E... C-O-M... I. I-N-G. I, I, and no, G. only no. one I. Only <laughs> one I, right? Uh huh, like this. <laughs> okay, thank you, Delia. I and G. So Janet is coming from work. That's it, right? Okay, I need one volunteer to read the five convers uh, five sentences, please. One volunteer, read, read for the class. Twenty four students. Come on, I need one one student. Me to share. Yeah, thank you, Brenda Lee. Ah, the microphone is working. Nice. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Action, Brenda Lee. Melanie is eating lunch in her bedroom. 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 Sylvia, eh, eh, only one. No, five. Okay. Silvia is putting on make makeup in the bathroom. Our children are getting up later tomorrow mor morning. Uh, later, I'm going shopping for clothes with my Boyfriend. <laughs> Boyfriend. Boyfriend. <clears throat> okay, good. <laughs> Janet is coming home early from work. Thank you. Thank you very much. Right now. Good. How to make to make yes no questions? With the present continuous, right? Remember, English is easy in the grammar. If you think that we have a simple structure, that is, listen, that is affirmative, negative, and question, right? Every uh, part here, the affirmative, the negative, and the question, it has the, its own structure, right? It's different. It's different, right? And notice that we always do the same. Ya se dieron cuenta que hemos venido haciendo lo mismo, ¿verdad? Desde, desde el verbo to be, desde el presente simple, desde todos los auxiliares que nosotros eh, 
hemos visto, pues, se usa afirmativo, negativo y pregunta afirmativo, negativo y pregunta afirmativo. Y ahí, pues, ahí está jugando. ¿verdad? Así que, si ustedes ya se pueden esa regla, pues, no les va a costar ninguna estructura, ¿sí? Ok. Now, in this case, verb to be at the beginning and then the subject. We don't say you are, you say are you. So, we change the position, right? You are, no, are you. And then the ing or the, the verb that has ing, the present participle. So, you say eating. Are you eating right, right now? Yes, I eating. <laughs> yes, I eating. No, 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 no. Is yes, I am for the bird to be. Oh, no, I'm not. Right? Is she, is she taking the bus? Yeah, she is. Or negative? No, she's not. No, she isn't, right? Is it raining? Yes, it is. No, it is not. Oh, no, it isn't, right? Are they walking? Yes, they are. No, they're not. Or you can say, no, they aren't, right? Good, any question? Any question, class? No? Okay. So let's continue, right? Here we have uh, some questions. And what are you going to do? Complete the question, right? Now we'll take my own volunteers. Voy a agarrar mis voluntarios porque casi solo me dejan a Adelia solita, ¿verdad? ¿Qué pasa ahí? Tenemos que apoyarla. <ríe> solo me dejan a Dino solito y a Dudley. Hoy sí vamos a agarrar nuestros propios voluntarios. Let's start with William. Please, William. Are you studying English, William? Yes. Yes. I. I study English. Yes, I am. I am studying English. No, no, no. Yes, I am. I, yes, I am. Only that, right? It's not. I mean, you can say, William. You can say yes. Yes, I am studying. It's correct. But normally, when you make question with yes, no question, people say only yes or no, or yes or no. Right? Simple. In this case, yes, I am. Right? Thank you, okay. William. Thank you very much. Now, Alexi, no, Alexi. Moisés, please. Okay. Next one. Is Selena taking out the garbage? Damn. Um, yes. Um, yes, she, she is. Yes, she... okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Give me a second. <laughs> ya me perdí aquí, permita. <laughs> okay. Yes, she is. Of course. Yes, she is. Because it's a woman? Yes, she is. Thank you very much. Okay. okay. Number three, right? Are one's children taking a nap? No. Um, let me see. Moises, please, Moises. Are Juan's children taking a nap? No, they aren't. No, they aren't, right? No, they aren't. Okay. Next one. Mateo, please help me, Mateo. Uh, the question is, are you eating pupusas right now? No, uh, I am not. No, I am not. No lo sé, Rick. He looks fake. <laughs> okay, digamos que sí, ¿verdad? Porque... Si no, nos va, lo, lo vamos a obligar a que nos comparta. Oiga, Mateo. <laughs> ok, Mateo. Now, María René, please. Number four, number five. Yes, number five. Ah, sorry. Ok. 
No, only that, right? Only four. Okay, now, unscramble. This is in disorder, so you're going to put it in order, right? Let me see. Yes. Vamos a poder trabajar un ratito, yes. Let me see cómo estamos como a cinco, unos cinco minutitos, yes. So please, three minutes, tres minutitos le vamos a, creo que lo pueden hacer en tres minutos, ok, ready? Now let's go to the groups, right? Vamos a hacerlo en grupo, eh, háganme capture pantalla, chicos. Capture pantallas, ready? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, yes, capture pantalla. Okay, now. Let's go to the group. Sala para grupos pequeños, right? Solo vamos a hacer tres. Que hay mucho oyente ahora, así que vamos a hacer tres. Ok. Ready? Good, please. Francisco is here. Welcome, Francisco. Puede participar. Sorry to be late. Oh. Um. Okay, I, I understand. Eh, pero no va manejando, ¿verdad, Francisco? No, no, pero voy llegando. <laughs> Perdón. Okay, tranquilo, va. Tómese su cafecito, su sándwich y después nos acompaña, ¿ok? <laughs> Good. Okay, eh, ¿alguien hizo el screenshot, chicos? Yo lo hice, Yo lo hice. Ah, vaya. Si pueden compartirlo entonces y empezamos a trabajar, ¿ya? ¿sí? Este, compartirlo donde teacher aquí en la sala. Sí se puede. Veamos, o si no se lo comparto yo, pero inténtelo, María. Mm, o, voy o a no sé, porque yo soy del cel. Ah, bueno, ¿quién está en computadora? María. Yo no. Cel, del celular estoy. Ah, bueno. Este, Elsa está en compu. Ok, Elsa, no está en compu. Ay, no. Oh. <risa> Nadie está en compu, María René. Voy al por teacher. <risa> oh, my God. No, no sé así. Mi computadora es usada. <risa> Así la que... mía de tanto usarla se arruinó ah, mucho juego, mucha novela <risa> okay. bueno, entonces si quieren bueno, eh, pueden trabajar con su celular le hicieron captura en su, en su celular sí, Yo sí. Ah, va. entonces comiencen bueno. me voy a ir a otro grupo y luego regreso con ustedes okay. In... New York. Mm -hmm. Number three. Uh -huh. ¿Quién es el tres? Sorry. Eso Diana. sería como la segunda. Your father is taking. Is Did you take the taking. screenshot? 
Boys, ¿le tomaron un screenshot o quieren que se los comparta? Ah, sí, tenemos la pantalla. Ah, ok, good. Continue, continue, so. Your father is taking a taxi to the restaurant. Your, your father Eh, el número dos. Your neighbors are doing the laundry. No, porque neighbors lleva your. No puede ir the neighbors. Your neighbors. Mm -hmm. the, no your puede. neighbors are doing the laundry. La casa, mi amor. Your, tus vecinos. Tus vecinos están haciendo la, 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 están lavando para mí. Your neighbors are doing the laundry. Okay. Okay. Eh, no sé, como al final era una cada uno, pero no. no ajá, ajá. Eh, ¿Sigo con la uno o no sé si apoyo? Ah, sí, sí. Okay. Eso. No, 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 no. Usted fue. ¿Cuál iba a decir? Yo tengo dudas en la segunda. Eh, Por el it. Pero que eh, se refiere a eso a. A, a, a eso está... no, es que no puedo armar la segunda me cuesta armar la segunda o sea, in New York it's raining o it's o sea, el it no sé dónde ponerlo Delia, it is the subject it mm -hmm. it's, it is raining in New York it is raining in New York. Yeah. Is it, it is raining in New York. Is it in New York It is. Uh -huh. It is raining in New York. Sí, lo ves. Hello, Hello, guys. Did you finish? Yes. Okay, okay. So, in a minute, I will call you in a minute, yes? Okay. Okay, good. Neighbors, neighbors, uh -huh. aquí no sé si ponerle doing, doing. De... Uh -huh. La laundry, laundry, uh -huh. doing the laundry, no sé si así está correcta, yo creo que sí, no sé si alguien más piensa que no, <ríe> no sé, <ríe> Es lo que y quién la va a leer si no ponen a leer una eh, eh, que, pero... sorry class for the interruption remember your group number one right group number one right yes sir in a minute I will call you in a minute are doing the laundry Sorry for the interruption. Don't forget that you are group number two, right? Group number mm -hmm. two. In a minute, we go together to the group. Okay.
Okay, I guess we are ready, right? I will share the, the screen again. Okay, we're gonna make it easy, right? Group number one, one. Group number two, two. Group number three, three. Group number one, four. Group number two, five. And group number number three, thank you very much. <laughs> okay, now number one, please. Group number one, please. Action. Boy. Are the children dressed getting out? Question. You make a question? Okay. Are the children dressed? Uh huh. Are the children dressed? Getting now. Getting now. And it's a question, right? Yes. Good. Number two. Group number two, please. Okay. Delia. It is raining in New York. New York. New York. Okay. Thank you. Number group number three. Uh, your father is uh, taking. Is taking a taxi to the restaurant. Mm -hmm. Very good. Number four, group number one again. Are my friends exercising to today? At home today. At home today. Question mark. Question mark. Good. Group number two, please. Your neighbors are doing the laundry. Okay, I will accept number four and number one as a question, right? But we don't see question mark, but that's okay. The idea is to practice. Teacher, now, let me see. Uh, yeah? In la uh, number uno, uh -huh. me falta la G. Okay. Y también sería, are, are the children getting now dresses uh -huh. mm -hmm. let me see is correct or incorrect what do you think is are the children uh -huh. getting... are the children getting getting, getting dresses i dress dress no dress now right and you say it's a question no problem are the yes. children getting dressed now? Good. Number two. Is it raining? It is raining in New York, right? Your father is taking a taxi to the restaurant. Are my friends exercising at home today? And finally, uh, your neighbors are doing the laundry. Okay. Excellent also. Excellent also, class. Congratulations, right? Now we're going to practice the last minutes of the class with some conversations. Good, listen. This is Walter. Hello, Walter. Where is Walter? He's in the kitchen. 
And what is he doing? He's eating breakfast, right? Now, repeat after me, please. Where's Walter? He's in the kitchen. What is he doing? He's eating breakfast. He's eating breakfast, right? Okay, good. Now, look at the picture number one. Karen. No Walter, Karen, right? No kitchen, park. No eating breakfast, eating lunch, right? Okay, two volunteers to make this conversation, please, very fast. Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, Moises. Moises, your letter A. Cool. Elsa. Elsa, your letter B. Ready? One, two, three, action. Uh, where's Karen? She's in the park. What, what he, what he doing? What she? What, what she doing? Excuse me. She's eating lunch. My goodness. Yes. Very good. Conversation two. Mr. and Mrs. Clark. Two volunteers. Two volunteers. Uh huh. Ingrid. Ingrid, your letter A. Now letter B, please. Letter B. Mateo. Mateo, thank you. Action. Where's. No, Mr. in this case, sorry, Ingrid. In this case, because it's plural, you say where are. Because it's Mr. and Mrs. Clark. Señor y señora Clark, right? So, yeah. where are? Come on, go ahead. Where are Mr. and Mr. Clark? Uh, they are in the dining room. Uh -huh. What? What are? What? What are? They. They. They do doing. Uh -huh. Doing correct. What are they doing? Uh huh. They okay. are eating dinner. Excellent. Also, I like it. I like it. The last conversation, please. And we finish the class. Come on, volunteers, practice. Don't be afraid. No tengan miedo. Don't Where be is... Ah, okay. Delia, Delia, your letter. Where a. are you? Where are you? Yes. No, but wait. I need another student, please. Who wants to help Delia? Me, teacher. Okay, good. Maria, right? Okay. So, uh, Delia, you make the question. Maria, the answer. Ready? One, okay. two, three. Where are, where are you? He is. No, I am. I am. I am. I am bedroom. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Um, play. Uh, he, she is playing. No, I am, I am. No, I am. Perdón. I am playing the guitar. Okie dokie. Thank you very much. Right? Love to you. Congratulations. Uh, tomorrow we're going to review a little bit about this. Nos quedaron unas conversaciones ahí. Okay, mañana las terminamos. Y unos pequeños ejercicios ahí. Ahí estamos. Solo eso nos quedó, ¿sí? Para mañana, dejémoslo. Para los primeros que se conectan, ¿verdad? Para practicar un ratito. ¿Ok, class? Eh, voy a tomar la asistencia rapidito. Solo quería saber si este, Jonathan se puede quedar conmigo unos 10 minutos. Bueno, menos, 9 minutos. <ríe> sí, teacher, sí. Sí, ok, good. Thank you, thank you. Vamos a anotarlo aquí. Ah. O ya se quedó con... No, Jonathan ya se quedó, ¿verdad, Jonathan? No, no, me había dicho el viernes, pero... Eh, no, no podía, pude. ¿va? Uh -huh. Ok, hoy sí, entonces. Thank you very much. Good. Say present, please. Say present, everybody. Eh, Ada. Present. Good night. Brenda Lee. 
Present, good night. See you tomorrow. Brenda. Present, good night. Bye bye, Carlos. Present. See you tomorrow, Francisco. Present. See you tomorrow, Francisco. Eh, Delia. Present, good night. Bye bye, good night, Elsa. Present, good, good night. Good night, God bless you. Enrique. Thank you. You're welcome. Present, good night. Okay, good night, God bless you, Enrique. Eh, Erenia. Present. Bye bye. Evelyn. Present, good night. Good night, God bless you. Freddy. Ingrid. Present, good night, teacher. Good night, Jessica. Araceli. Jessica Carolina. Jonathan. No se me va a ir, Jonathan. Present. Ok, Kenia. María del Carmen. Bye bye. Ok, Kenia. Ok, María. See you on Monday. See you on Monday. See you tomorrow. Ok, see you on Ya lo estoy despachando toda la semana. Ok, tomorrow. María René. Present. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Mateo. Present. Good night. Ok, take care. Moisés. Present teacher. Bye bye. God bless you. Alexi. Wilfredo. William. Good night. Good night. God bless you. Wilmer. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it, right? Thank you very much. Goodbye, everybody. Okay, Jonathan. Hello, Jonathan. Tiene su cámara funcionando, Jonathan. Me está fallando ahorita la está computadora, fallando. teacher. Ajá. Bueno, no, no, por ese caso, no, mejor. Entonces, Como que sí. me, me dice que es un software, entonces tengo que instalarlo. Sí, bueno, qué lástima, pero... Lástima, bueno. Pero si lo enciende, se, ¿verdad? Ahí lo único que puede hacer usted es pagar el, el requisito de esta clase, que es eh, compartir la, la semita una noche. <risa> ok. Ah, Jonathan, ¿qué tal le ha parecido el... Segundo nivel, segundo que estamos con usted, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, súper bien, teacher. ¿Le parece bien? Apre sí, sí, aprendiendo siempre. Estamos participando más, ¿verdad? Hoy. Sí, como que, eh, más que todo, como cuando uno, bueno, por lo menos yo, cuando comencé a como aprenderme, por lo menos el, el, el abecedario, como que ya se le, se le haya como, como saber rimarla o saberlo decirlas las palabras en inglés. Ah, y si no leo. se los inventa, pero <risa> ya, ya, lo, ya lo toma como uno más. Sí, más, más con más? confianza, va. más con uh -huh. confianza, siento yo. Sí, pues sí. bien, sí, yo, yo me he fijado cuando usted participa en las conversaciones y mejor, mejor que, que obviamente, va. Sí, que la el verdad. Curso anterior. Que... Que se le va quitando a uno el, lo tímido, el miedo de equivocarse, sí. pues todos nos equivocamos. Por sí, en la primera con, yo me acuerdo que en las pre, primeras conversaciones usted titubeaba mucho, eh, se quedaba, pero hoy ya veo. Por, que... el mismo, por los mismos nervios, quizás, y sí. eso, entonces, pero. Pero ahora solo una, dos palabritas y ahí va con todo, Jonathan. Sí, la idea es. Sí. Pues salir y, hablando inglés. ¿Y cómo se llama? Ha estado practicando en su. ¿Tiempo libre? ¿Le queda tiempo libre o casi no? Los fines de semana. Ah, ok. Pero como paso con mi hija, trato ah. de poner como muñequitos lo que, lo que hablábamos la vez pasada. La vez pasada, sí. ¿Y, ¿Y qué pasó? La niña está viéndolos en inglés. Sí. Sí, incluso ella ve hasta en chino, pero o sea, <risa> no lo entiende, pero yo trato de, no. de ponerle... Me parece algo gracioso, perdón, Jonathan, pero hasta en chino. Sí, sí, tengo no, no, una caricatura pero... por ahí. Bueno, por lo menos, por la mayoría, pónganselo usted en inglés. Uh -huh. Hay una bien bonita, no sé si se la recomendé la vez pasada, sin cantar. No, no. Buenísima, ¿verdad? no sé si tiene usted Netflix, en Netflix aparece. Sí, sí, sí. sí ah, pues ahí está, y búsquelo. Net, eh, sin, sin cantar. Sin, ajá, cantar, así se llama, sin que son unos animalitos que salen cantando, pero buena música. Oh, y no hablan bien claro. Y también pets, mascotas, otro buenísimo. 
que hablan bien claro. O sea, a la niña le va a gustar, así que se lo recomiendo, ¿verdad? Y los videos que mando entre semanas los he estado viendo. Sí, sí. Sí. En el tiempo libre que me queda de, Qué bueno. eh, al mediodía, me pongo ahí veces a verlo. Qué bueno. Hoy tra eh, hablamos del vocabulario, la diferencia entre make y do. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? ¿verdad? Ahí el video explicaba que eh, cuando usted dice make, es que usted inventa algo nuevo. Make, por ejemplo, make dinner, hacer la cena. ¿verdad? No, usted no dice do, do dinner, sino que make dinner. Uh -huh. o, o también cómo hacer la tarea, ¿va? do homework. Entonces, no es Sí, que usted sí. la inventó la tarea, sino que usted solo la va repitiendo, va repitiendo algo que alguien hizo, ¿verdad? Esa es la diferencia, pero ahí usted ve el video y practíquelo, ¿verdad? Sí, la verdad que sí le ayuda a uno bastante. Por lo menos se siente como en la necesidad de ver qué es lo que dicen, o sea, en interpretar, entender qué es lo que hablan Sí. cuando uno ve. Y como lo escucha, como lo que usted me dice, los muñequitos hablan como bien despacio, se entiende mejor, se comprende. Más entendible, sí. Uh -huh. Correcto. Sí, yo lo felicito también por la plataforma que va al día, ¿verdad? Unidad 1, Sí, unidad 2. lo, lo que pasa, teacher, es que no trato de adelantar. Hay veces que me queda tiempo, pero no lo hago para adelantarme porque quiero, porque como veo la clase, entonces la clase se, se basa a, a eso, Ajá, entonces... correcto, sí. Ahí como que hasta comprendo un poco más el examen y todo. No voy como Tim Marín de dos pingües. Ni a la rápida, sino que va, Ajá. sabe que va haciendo. Está en la jugada, Trato ¿verdad? de, trato de interpretar un poco. Caba. Es Bueno. que si la idea es salir hablando inglés, Tich, con That's toda it. la actitud. Excelente. I like that attitude. I like it. <ríe> ok, por último la música. Dígame la última canción que practicó. Vamos a ver. Ah, la que nos mandó usted, la escucho bastante. La de No me acuerdo Metallica cómo se llama. o... Sí, una metálica, eh. Nothing else matters. Ese es buenísimo. Y la, la última que les mandé es la de Beds of Burning, un grupo australiano. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Esa escena la escucho, le mentiría si le digo Sí. que sí, dice. When the beds are burning. Oh, aquí How está can we el dance if the beds are burning? ¿Verdad? Habla de la naturaleza. Que, ¿Cómo podemos dormir si la, estamos contaminando la tierra? Es bien bonita la canción. Midnight Oil, es un grupo australiano de los, la música es de los 90. Mm. Buenísimo, Ahorita, ahí se, ahí se puede practicarla, pues. cabal, ahorita, la, ahorita ya para dormir me lo voy a Ah, poner va, excelente, para práctica, Jonathan. práctica, práctica. I, I really like your attitude, eh. You're, you're really positive, I like it, right? And I hope your daughter can learn English with you together, right? Sí, sí. Yes. Because in this moment, she's a spongy, you know, una esponjita. Right? She's Uh absorbing everything. Todo lo está absorbiendo, ¿verdad? Así que a nosotros -huh. Sí, ya nos ese. cuesta un poquito más porque ya estamos más... Bueno, yo, a usted está así pote todavía, pero... Ni, ni tanto, pero <risa> cuando pero sí... uno, Si cuando uno se lo propone, lo cumple, Ticha. Así es. Eso es correcto, Metas. Jonathan. ¿Ok? No sé si Uh tiene -huh. alguna pregunta de algún tema que le cueste o, o vamos bien. Ahorita, gracias a Dios, sí. Ahí tratando de entender un poquito más, pero sí, sí, es entendible El presente continuo bastante. sí vamos a practicarlo mañana, un repaso ahí y después seguimos con, siempre con el presente continuo. ¿eh? Sí, vamos a practicar bastante, así que creo que no nos va a quedar ninguna duda, Jonathan. Ok, Ok. so it's a pleasure, Jonathan, and thank you for staying with me these minutes. I will see you tomorrow, right? Right, Jonathan, God bless you. Have a good night. Hola, su...